look at our radar and it was a little bit more active as we moved on into this afternoon, at least for some of you folks to the south and southeast primarily of the Metroplex. Those showers and storms quickly did die down as we got into the 7 and 8 o'clock hour, lost the sunlight, and now we are drier. Now that is not a one-day deal. We're going to have several days to see more scattered showers and storms in the mix. Your eye is drawn to all that moisture in the Gulf, and that's what's going to pump in more moisture for us this week. So we will see, again, some rounds of scattered rain off and on, no washouts, but off and on the next several days. Tomorrow, rain chances actually going up to about 40%. We'll see those rain chances even a little bit higher on Tuesday. And then it's not over by then. Wednesday, Thursday, continued off and on rainfall, especially it looks like across our south. And east, we will have a better shot to see some of that rain into this week, which we really need. Moderate drought levels are across much of North Texas. Our warm temperatures stuck around today and tonight, too. 84 for Dallas, 87 for Fort Worth, dew points in the low 70s. So it does stay super muggy out there. 93 is how it feels in Fort Worth right now. Temperatures across the area, low to mid 80s. Louisville 85, as well as Flower Mound. Burleson 82 and Mansfield, you're checking in right now at 83 degrees. So overnight tonight, look for temperatures to continue to fall as well as these feels like temperatures, but they will stay a little bit higher as our humidity is not going to go anywhere the next several days. Temperatures falling into the upper 70s tomorrow. Little rain chances for us to start the day. We'll be watching a bit of a wave try to push this way. And you can see that on this model, some very, very light isolated type showers perhaps in the morning. Then I think again in the afternoon we'll be talking about some scattered showers and storms. Better shot it looks like we'll be east of the Metroplex. We dry out for a bit on Monday night and then we look ahead to Tuesday. Wednesday look at this. Tuesday more scattered showers and storms again east of I-35 a better shot and then Wednesday and Thursday what do you know another round scattered showers and storms starting to dry out finally on Thursday. Nice to see the temperatures coming down. Actually, we're talking below average temperatures in the mid to upper 80s for several days as we will officially start summer. Go figure. Cooler temperatures and summer officially starting. Rainfall totals, our models have had a little bit of trouble trying to pick up on how much this system does bring us, but I do think some widespread amounts of half of an inch up to an inch plus will be possible the next several days. Temperatures tonight, upper 70s. Tomorrow we are talking low 90s and keeping that rain in the forecast off and on into this new work week. Summer is here. And